Hi everyone, my name is Rajeshekar. Welcome to my channel. This is a quick video about the DMX templates which I create and to explain why they are being created and also to clarify how you can use that in your projects. I have made a video which shows you the steps of customizing the DMX templates which I create. That shows you how you can use my DMX lights into any map of your choice in Unreal Engine. So do check that video out if you haven't. Usually when you get any map in Unreal Engine from Marketplace, it could be free or a paid version. You would find a set like this. There won't be any DMX lights on the map. It is part of a virtual studio template and it's called Studio D map. So this was a newsroom template. So any Unreal Engine map which you download might not have all these DMX lights placed handy. So what I do is I place all the DMX lights right now. I've hidden it for you. Let me unhide it. So I have placed lights all across the set. Some are in the ring, some in the rear, some in the top, left, right, and everything is categorized in the folder. I have three sets of lights. One is for Sharpie, Strobe, and Wash. And further, the folders are subdivided based on their positions on set and number of lights. After placing lights and organizing them, I also create a DMX library for you. This is the library for this map, which is Studio DDMX. When you get inside that, you can see the types of lights on set and their corresponding modes. And I've also patched them all, the corresponding universes. And you can see the lights are patched. And this map utilizes 11 universes. And I use Camsys lighting program. Why Camsys? Because there are many lighting programs out there. But I personally prefer Camsys because Camsys offers currently 18 universes for us to test freely on a program. Right now on the screen, I'm showing a video which shows you the complete workflow of Unreal Engine and Camsys. Do check that out. So that was about the Unreal Engine. So I place lights, group them, and I create a DMX library as well. Once that is done, I get inside Camsys and I create all the light groups. So information of all these lights and the corresponding universe has been fed into Camsys program. And if I want to trigger this set of lights in the rear, all you need to do is in the Camsys program, you need to click on this particular group and click locate. So that was an example for the Sharpies on the top. I can show you one more example. So let's look at the center ring. We have three layers of ring and you can notice I've created three separate Sharpie groups. So this is first innermost ring, the middle ring and the third. If you want to select them all together, you can click on this and that selects all the ring sharpies you also have complete control over the dmx template i create you're not just tied to the light setup which i create you can also modify this as long as you're maintaining the position based on the group what i meant to say is if you notice a set of lights here you can modify them as required only on this position but do not change their position to the right so there are two templates which i offer one is partial dmx template and one is complete when i say partial i give you the complete light setup on the unreal engine map like this and also the light groups are created in Camsys and samples of lights recorded as playbacks. And I would give you a Camsys show file. So to use Camsys show file, you need to have Camsys program installed uh, in your computer. Let me quickly show you the Camsys version, which I'm referring to in your search engine, search for Magic Q Camsys, and you would get this website, Magic Q software by Camsys. I'm referring to this software. So it's Magic Q software free magic use of the download the show file which is which contains all this information and you would require to place that show file in your documents magic Q show folder so there is one more template which goes by the name complete dmx template in that template what i do i give you same as before i give you the complete light setup and these light uh, groups and campuses in addition to that I would be giving you a show file which would contain all the uh, playbacks I recorded for the song along with the timeline. For example, you can see this is the map which I recently used for programming Halo music. So I would be giving you a complete Camsys show file which would have the cues which I used for the song along with the timeline which has all the information of recorded lights as per beats. You can re-record or modify some light colors or styles for any beats which you require and, and you can create your own version. So that's the use of my DMX templates. Hope you understood what I was trying to convey. Do check out my uh, DMX templates playlist and the playlist title also has the Unreal version which it supports. If you wish to have access to any templates I create, 
do check out the description of that video i have shared my whatsapp number along with email address whatever ways you are comfortable you can reach me and mention the template you need and i will share further details on it so that was a quick video on my dmx templates hope that clarified all the doubts you had see you all soon on another video i'm rajshekar signing out bye take care